Looking live at chopper pictures from our Sky 9 this morning, you can see the amount of smoke that's just hanging in the sky. The winds have died down, which is giving firefighters a break and a chance to switch out crews after nearly two days on the fire lines. But of course, no end in sight for these fires. It is still not contained at this point, the Woolsey fire. That's right, Suzanne. I'm Peter Dow. Thanks for being with us, folks. 200,000 people and 75,000 homes have been evacuated. At least 39,000 acres gone. This fire still at zero containment. As we mentioned, the Woolsey fire is still growing at a very slow pace. Again, the good news, the winds are starting to die down. That was the biggest factor in how quickly they spread yesterday. Still heading towards the coast, though, and officials say at least two people have died. It's unknown yet if those deaths are actually connected to the fire. So definitely still a lot of concern right now for people all across our region. We also talked about the air quality and how bad it is. So even if you're not directly in the vicinity of the flames, you're still going to be impacted because we all have to breathe this air that now is just so smoky, so much ash. People's cars are now covered in ash. People having, who have asthma issues or the elderly, they're the most susceptible.